hi welcome now i am going to show you how to hide blank rows in a pivot table okay so what i am going to do is i have uh, students uh, okay and the total marks scored by the student each student and their total subjects this is our uh, source data okay so i am going to select the source data and these three columns and insert a pivot table okay so now what i'm going to do is uh, this is my total table range uh, okay and my table range is this uh, okay the three columns and uh, uh, where do, where do i want to place the pivot table report to be in a new worksheet okay press okay now it goes for two areas one is the pivot table report area and the fields uh, list from the field list i can select any fields i want to analyze and create the pivot table okay pivot table fields list pan is this one okay and uh, this is the area okay i what i'm going to do is i'm going to select the student and the total marks okay and the subjects okay now what happens you can see here that uh, there is a blank record here okay so how can i hide it okay f in the first place why this blank record is coming okay this blank record comes uh, because you selected uh, or uh, i selected uh, this one as a row as a two three columns and i didn't select the exactly this way okay probably i can select this one i will create in a new uh, uh, table you can see what happens you can see no blank record at all okay but in this uh, worksheet why it is coming because i selected a uh, instead of uh, the range exactly with uh, 13 records here i selected uh, as a uh, column wise okay that's why the blank is coming okay then why why should i why shouldn't i select this way but uh, why should i select this way okay what is the difference because because what i'm doing is i'm giving a higher range uh, all three columns because uh, this pivot table tomorrow what will happen i will add uh, some other student okay and refresh the pivot table that's my objective okay but uh, if we, uh, if i select it only for the 13th row then i need to redo the pivot table to change the source range okay if i select it as a column wise then i don't need to redo it i just type in whatever number of student if tomorrow i have 10 more students i just uh, type in and uh, just refresh the pivot table that's my objective that's why i selected like this okay if uh, okay if such cases these blank records come in then how can i hide this one okay very fine you can do it uh, this is low row label i say student okay in the student what i am going to do in the filter you go here you can see here at the end uh, there is a blank so uncheck it press ok ok so now it is gone so whenever you find some blank you want to hide it you can do it this way ok you can jo go to the filter and uh, take out the blank record ok so this is uh, my objective and to be fun part of it uh, you have uh, this record is uh, blank also for the student 7 okay you want to hide it you can do it uh, this way but uh, this is not the right way to do it uh, then uh, if you want uh, you can do it this way okay hide that blank but uh, that is not a uh, right way uh, our objective here is to just to hide the blank record okay hope uh, this video is uh, helpful to you if you like my video please subscribe to my channel the alan sum button is already appearing in your video just press it then you will get uh, 
subscription um, uh, and also uh, please leave your comments and I value your comments and um, uh, I will improvise my videos in future okay using your comments okay and uh, have a good day and God bless you okay